All right, hey guys, uh, Robbie here from New Canoe. Just gonna take you walk through our new uh, H2 Pro Pad. Um, new for 2017, gonna be coming out here in the next few months, available 2018. Just gonna give you a quick walk through of kind of what we've got going on. First off, as you can see, um, gonna be a little bit different uh, than most of the other pedal drives. You can see this one actually drops down into our tracks, um, which is gonna be really great. Uh, if you have a previous version, 2012 to current, Frontier or Pursuit, it will adapt to that. As you can see, we have an open construction here. Uh, it's belt driven, which is definitely different from most other companies. It's not sealed, it's wide open, so not a whole, no maintenance at all. Um, you know, anything you get inside here is not gonna really affect it. So you can see a little bit other different things. It runs off a cable drive system. So we have a conduit system that runs all the way to the back. So we actually have uh, the rudder and proper actually, and the propeller are in the back. So. Again, a def different setup than you would see for most other boats, but I think one of the biggest benefits for this boat, um, it really allows you to uh, control the pitch of your nose of your boat without actually drafting your whole boat side to side. It allows you just to pitch your nose left or right, uh, you know, whether you're in wind, current, or you just want to face the action in a different direction. And another good, cool benefit about this is we actually have this really cool uh, quick release system back here. So as you see right now, it's in the lock position. That allows you to use reverse and forward freely. Uh, if you want to uh, just disengage the lock, just give it a little tug here. There's a handle in the front that allows it to freely kick up. So if you're coming in somewhere shallow or if you're afraid you're going to be hitting obstructions, it um, allows you to do that. Yet at the same time, you can also pull that cord all the way and it actually will retract that motor up and out of the water, out of the way for whether you're coming into the beach, storing, or if you just need to clean the prop, you get some weeds in it as well. So as you can see, we still have this wide open cockpit set up. You know, sticking true to new canoe, wide open, uh, extremely stable. And the night really other benefit about this pedal drive system is it bolts on and off. There is no hole in the boat. Um, you know, buying a new boat if you want to get the pedal drive system installs on and off, you know, within five to ten minutes. So we're pretty pumped on it. You know, we're averaging speeds around three and a half to four miles an hour and, you know, kind of a comfortable pedaling speed. Um, and you got your control toggle here, which allows you to steer left and right. which is uh, just really keeps it awesome, you know, remains hands-free, uh, just minor touch adjustments with the toggle handle there. Yes, this will work with the Frontier and Pursuit, um, all previous models and new models as well. So uh, very adaptable, um, makes it easier for previous customers, not gonna have to purchase a new boat just to get the pedal drive system. So I think it's gonna be really beneficial for some of those previous owners. And uh, the price point's gonna be right around $1,000. So for those people who are a little uh, worried about buying a new boat with a pedal drive system, gonna break the bank, you know, New Canoe definitely has a solution for uh, any of your previous boats or any prior new boats, so. So we had the opportunity to take the New Canoe Frontier out. It was fitted with the H2 Pro Ped system. Uh, initially, when you get on it, you need to adjust your seat so that you have the optimal pedal positioning. Initially, when I ended up doing it, I had my seat a little bit too far back, which led to my legs overextending and I had a little bit of a choppy appearance with pedaling. Once I moved the seat forward, everything smoothed out. It was very comfortable to pedal and uh, I highly enjoyed it. The drive is very quiet. It's probably the most quiet drive I've tested. Forward and reverse is very easy to transition between and it being a new canoe, it's highly stable. Uh, your turning is highly dependent on your speed. The faster you're pedaling, the tighter it turns. Check out the link in the video description below for more details. Thanks for watching.